haven't subscribed yet hit the subscribe button and the bell icon to get instantly notified from the updates of being civil a complete civil engineering tutorial channel happy learning hello everybody welcome to being civil in this video we will learn how to draw rectangle squared in AutoCAD We are choosing auto, uh, ACAD ISO.dwt as template file. Uh, we are using um, A4 size paper. So, before going to the drawing, uh, we will set the limit of the paper. The command to set the limit is limits. S specify lower left corner is 00, zero. In the upper right corner. Uh, the coordinate is 297 uh, comma 210 as if the A4 size paper is in landscape orientation so this is our paper we will draw the rectangle square in this paper so this is the one uh, rectangle and square you see in this picture so uh, it is very common that to draw rectangle two points you have to know that is one is the lower left corner of the rectangle and another is the upper right corner of the rectangle otherwise you have to know um, the two sides of the rectangle So uh, let's draw the rectangle in the AutoCAD. So this is the paper. The comment to draw rectangle is REC. Hit enter. Specify first corner. You see in the image uh, the uh, first corner that is the lower left corner is 3,3. Write down 3 comma 3 hit enter you uh, see the lower left corner gets fixed so the upper right corner that is the opposite corner of the first point the coordinate is 10 comma 6 So you got the rectangle. Let's try to draw this same rectangle with the help of the length of the two sides. You see in the rectangle here the this side is of 7 unit and this side is uh, 3 units so let's write the rectangle comment again specify first corner I am clicking anywhere on the page the lower uh, corner gets fixed now I have to specify the other corner point in this case we will take help from the uh, relative coordinate system those who have not seen the video of coordinate system just go to the previous video the link is also in the description uh, go and watch the video and learn how relative coordinate system works the we have to go 7 units in x direction and 3 units in y direction so at the rate 7 in positive x comma 3 in positive y so you get the same rectangle now uh, let's draw the square square is nothing but rectangle 
and the adjacent sides are equal so this comment is same rectangle in the picture you see the squared the lower left corner corner is 20 comma 5 and upper 25 comma 10 so just specify these points 20 comma 5 hit enter and 25 comma 10 the other corner point you get the square now uh, we will draw the rectangle with the help of line command I'm clicking the point anywhere on the page and you see the common prompt area is saying specify next point so the next point of the rectangle is in the positive x direction 7 units away from the first point at the rate 7 comma 0 you get second point the third point is at the rate uh, 3 units in y direction so x is 0 y is 3 now the next point uh, is 7 units in the minus x direction uh, let's take the help of total coordinate system at the rate 7 units angle what is the angle it is 180 degree and the four, uh, last point is the same as the first point you can click on this and um, you can give the coordinates also or just to close you can close the line it will the close command will close the line to the first point it was started and just write C and enter you see the rectangle strong the uh, difference between drawing with a rectangle command or a line command is that you see in this case this is a single and in this case there are four different objects four lines this uh, this rectangle there's four lines which is all are individuals entity but in if you draw with the rectangle command the this is a single entity the single entity uh, this is all in the next video we'll learn how to draw circle ellipse uh, if you like this video just hit a thumbs up those who have not subscribed yet hit the subscribe button to stay updated of the latest videos from being civil stay tuned happy learning